Last two years, um, finishing second in state in singles. Uh, take me through. Uh, obviously, it's exciting to to get that, but it's is it somewhat frustrating knowing that you're, you're pretty close? Uh, a little bit. It's um, it's not. It's it's tough taking second, but you know, it's uh, it's fine. Like, if I, as long as I play a good match and I lose, I'm good with it. As long as like it's fair calls, so I'm not really mad about it. I just want to come out and play my hardest, like I usually do. That's what I've done the last two years, and I'm gonna just leave it all on the court. Has it, you know, the end of last year, two years in a row, has it lit more of a fire in your gut? Is it? Yeah, I think so. Um, like, both years I played, I got taken out in the semifinals, and um, I really wanted to win both of them, but um, this, the players I was playing, was they were playing really fantastic, and my hat's off to them to beating me and them going on to playing in the finals. You feel like you've come into your senior season it's your last go around. Do you feel like you have more of a chip on your shoulder now? Yeah, I think uh, my mental game's a lot better. Like, I know um, my strokes are fantastic, I believe. I know I can beat anyone Christian, in the state, just depending on how I am at that time. And I know there's multiple players in the state who can beat me. It's just, it's gonna be a real competitive one singles this year. And I, I think I do have a good chance, but you never know what's gonna happen. Coach said that, you know, about midway through last year, you started to be more relaxed and, and really yeah. less serious. How has that helped you, and is that something that you really want to key on this year? Yeah, I think it's important, though, because, like, if you get uh, tight enough, you tend to, um, I just missed, and I was like, I'm going to come out, play my game, hit my shots, and I think it changed my game around because I wasn't afraid to miss, and it just it evolved, like, just really made my game a lot better because I left it all on the court. I was like, I'm either the better player or he is, and just the way it was. What's your mindset coming into your final season for Central? Um, I'm going to play uh, competitive. I'm going to play hard. Um, I think uh, I played. I started playing my freshman year, and I think I practiced really hard, and um, I want to win, and I know uh, a lot of people want to win. I'm going to come out, play play hard, and you know what? I think it's important just to have fun as well because it's my senior year, and it's my final year, and I'm just going to come out and play my game, and if I win, I win. And if I lose, it is what it is. You mentioned the mental part of your game was much better than last yeah. year. What are some other things that you feel like you've really improved on that could possibly help you get over the top here? Um, I think my biggest thing is I've done a lot of conditioning lately. Like last year, I kind of like slacked on it, but I've been out running probably for four to an hour mostly every other day. I've been doing wind sprints. So physically, I think I'm probably maybe one of the best fit players in the state. And I think if I know if the match lasts two or three hours, I'm probably going to take it, and I'm just going to, or if I do lose, I'm going to make sure make sure that they're sore the next day. What do you feel like it's going to take for you to, to get a state championship? <laughs> got to be consistent. I think um, you got to, like, you just, I got to play out of my mind. I think, I think if I, I think if I can play the way I play, I think I have a great shot at playing at it. Um, you got to, there's great players in the state. You have Brendan Locke, who's just, he's, playing beautiful he's a returning state champion you got to give it to him he's probably the favorite um, I want a little payback from my um, from him from him taking me out in this in the uh, semifinals last year but uh, I just hope to meet him in the finals this year and if I win I win I lose I lose but I think just playing with all I have is my final year I got nothing to lose so obviously Brendan's probably like you said the favorite to repeat again a guy not with with not many weaknesses. No. What's it going to take uh, for you to 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 beat him? I think um, a lot, I played him earlier, probably right before the season. I went uh, 0 and 4 against him. We had a fantastic second set. He broke me right in the end. I was uh, just he hit. I was serving and he just hit the line and I was like, great shot. And it's the way he played. And I was like, congratulations on the match. I think the best way to beat him is just to outlast him in the points. He's um, he's a fantastic. He doesn't give up. And if I get try to get careless and try to hit bigger than him, I'll lose. And I'm just going to make sure our match is long and painful for him. If he wins, my hat's off to him, but I'm going to make sure it's uh, he earns it. All right. Thank you very much. No problem.